Jonathan Taylor and Justin Jefferson won Offensive Player of the Week. Justin Jefferson had 169 receiving yards and two touchdowns. Jonathan Taylor had 204 total yards and five touchdowns. I feel you could also add Austin Eckler. He had like four touchdowns this week, and he honestly had a great game. Who did you guys put as Offensive Player of the Weeks? This is what a what-if would be like if a 12-team scenario happened in college football, which I wonder what you guys think about it. I don't know if it would really work out that well. I feel like there's a lot more teams, and I just don't think it would really viable the best teams in the nation and stuff like that. I think there'd be a lot of upsets out this, and I don't really like the idea of having this many games to decide a championship. And I think they're I eventually they'd probably even put it up to even more, like 16 or something like that. I think that'd be way too much to decide who's going to be in the college football playoff or win exactly. I think eight would probably be the amount I would go to, or six. I don't think anywhere over that I would ever go. Where would you guys, how many would you like to see? And do you think 12 is even possible? I don't think 12 team is even that good of a scenario in general. And I don't think they should do this. Telling me they're not going to flex us, Dan Campbell and the Lions playing on Thanksgiving. Do you guys think the Lions are going to beat the Bears on Thursday? I don't really see the Lions beating the Bears. I think it would be a very tough win for them to get, but I'm not really sure. I think Justin Fields will probably play well, and I think that would be the deciding factor. Hopefully he does play because Andy Dolan was actually in last week, and who knows how well he'll play against them. They, The Lions could definitely win this game, but who do you guys pick to win?